Hey there, it's Valerica. In a couple of minutes, I'll walk you through jailbreaking iOS 17.3.1 with no computer involved, and it's a piece of cake I promise. So keep your eyes peeled and don't miss a beat. By the end of this video, you'll have a fully untethered Saleo installed on your device running iOS 17.3.1. I'll also show you how to install cool tweaks like this music widget right under your dock icons or getting a quick underdock options like this to speed up your typing experience. Okay, let's get this show on the road. First, let me show you the current iOS version on my iPhone. As you can see, it's the latest iOS 17.3.1. Before jailbreaking, you need to follow few steps to make sure your iPhone is ready to be jailbroken. So, go back to Main Settings page, then choose General, Background App Refresh. Choose this option and make sure it is set to Wi-Fi and mobile data. Once this is done, go back to Main Page, then scroll down a bit and choose this battery option. Here, make sure the low power mode is turned off. If it's turned on like this, you're gonna see a yellow colored battery icon. So make sure you keep this option off. All right, that's all we gotta do to make sure our device is ready to be jailbroken. Next, open up Safari browser. Don't use any other browser than Safari. Now, go to this website, jbelectra.com. Be sure to enter the website link correctly. I'll drop this link in the first comment below. The site will do some security check that should be done in few seconds. All right, so the site has been loaded and this is what it looks like. You can read all about the jailbreak down here if you have some time. Otherwise, let's just head towards the jailbreak process. The first step is to jailbreak the iPhone remotely, then install the Saleo app. So go ahead and click on the download button. Now there's a social locker. Since this website offers the jailbreak tool for free, in exchange, you need to complete their sponsored social survey. You can share this site on Facebook or Twitter or subscribe to a YouTube channel. It's your choice. I'll go with YouTube subscribe option. So go ahead and click on this little YouTube icon and you will be redirected to a YouTube channel. Here, just click on the subscribe button. Once you subscribed, make sure to set the notification to all. Once you've done all that, return to the browser and the download button should be unlocked. Click on download. Then it'll ask for permission to download the Electra configuration profile. Click allow. Now the Electra configuration profile is downloaded and ready to be installed. So go to home screen and open up settings. Click on profile downloaded button, which you can find on the top of the settings page. Here, choose install. Enter your iPhone passcode if required. Click next and finally install the Electra configuration profile. There you go, the Electra profile is now installed. Then go back to home screen and open the Electra app. It might take a bit to load fully, given how many people are using it. Once it's loaded, click on the Start Jailbreak button. It'll start verifying your device and check jailbreak compatibility. Give it a few seconds to scan your device. I'll just speed up through this part. Proceed and confirm your current iOS version here. Now just click on Confirm Yourself, then click Close, and click Close one more time. And we're off! Jailbreaking is underway. Just be patient and let it do its thing. I'll fast forward this part too. All right guys, the jailbreak has been completed. If you've been following along, you should see Saleo being extracted from this app. As you can see, it's giving me the option to install Saleo. Go ahead and do that. Saleo is now installing on my iPhone. Give it a moment to complete. There you have it. Saleo is installed on my iPhone. Go ahead and open it. Voila. We've got a fully functional Sileo. As you can see, I am able to see all the free and paid tweaks here. I am also able to navigate through different pages. Now it's time for some tweaks. I will be installing Multipla Lite. Multipla Lite brings a bit of the power from Multipla right to your dock for free. Featuring the music widget from Multipla, Multipla Lite allows you to get a feel for Multipla before you purchase the full version. Although there is a full paid version, you can see enjoy a lot of other cool features of this tweak and free version. Just go ahead and install this tweak. Once it's installed, you need to respring the device so that the tweak can be configured properly. All right, now just unlock your device to see the effect. So here it is guys. All you need to do now is just swipe the dock to get the music widget here. This is super cool guys. And this feature of Multipla Light is really awesome. Now, let's move on to another fun tweak. Here I am going to install a tweak called Underdock. 
Underdock brings new actions on the keyboard dock view. The native keyboard on iOS provides some fundamental features, but its functionality can be significantly enhanced through jailbreaking and the utilization of tweaks like the recently unveiled Underdock. It allows you to place useful actions under your keyboard dock. Just go ahead and install the tweak. After installation, you need to respring your device again. All right, now all you have to do is just go somewhere. Like this message app and open the keyboard. Here you see, a dedicated preference pane has been be added to the stock keyboard app. You can do all sort of things quickly, like easily navigating to the start or end of a document, or perform quick copy and paste operation. Access the emoji options more quickly. You can even customize these options from settings, isn't it cool? So, so, this is how you can jailbreak iOS 17.3.1 and install some amazing tweaks using Cileo. If you bump into any issues, drop me a message in the first comment below and I'll be more than happy to help. But make sure you've liked this video and subscribe to my channel first. Thanks for watching my video, catch you later.